Here's an interesting one for you guys. I figured I'd do an interesting little break. Two thousand, or two thousand, haha. Nineteen ninety Fleer. This is nineteen ninety one Fleer basketball. These are the Clico packs. So they were all pre pre priced. Uh, Forty three cards a pack, and twenty four packs per box. Uh, I picked this up locally, and as you see, I'm gonna open it. Uh, obviously, uh, if you've done any research, uh, there's not a whole lot uh, worthwhile in the set. It looks pretty low. However, um, the big uh, the big guns are your, uh, hopefully we'll pull one, are the Rookie Sensations. I don't even remember how much they pulled. I think at one point you could actually search the uh, side packs. Uh, memory serves me right there in the middle, but I could not tell you how many of them are per box or not. Ro David Robinson's your big one. Um, and then, you know, see, there's your Jordan. So... But, um, DeBow, if you happen to watch this, uh, this is uh, the break as promised for you. So, 43 cards per pack. Uh, I think it's... I don't remember how many cards are set anymore. It used to be, I think, 200. But, well, let's see, here's the checklist. That goes to uh, 198. So, that may be as high as it goes. But this break will be more than likely really quick. Uh, could be rather painful because I probably overpaid for the box locally. But that's just the way it goes. Figured it'd be something kind of fun and interesting to break. And this is definitely something I haven't opened in a long time. Um, oh, rats, I thought I saw some green. Green or blue? But uh, given how well the box is packed, I don't think it was really searched. But uh, it came in second hand to the store, so it's very possible it was uh, searched. But Since I didn't look at a Beckett, I've got no clue. Uh, I can't tell. At this point, I thought they were on the end, or the uh, the middle, but we're going for pack six, so this will put me 25% down in the uh, on the break, and uh, we haven't hit one. So there's a Pippin in there. So if you're a, you've been around the block a little bit, uh, some of these players will <laughs> more than ring a bell. Kind of surprised the condition on these really doesn't seem to be all that great. Uh, checklist 1 through 100, so it may be 198, maybe 200 on the set. Carl Malone. And there's your Rodman back when he played for the Bad Boys. There's your Robinson rookie. Hey. I think they're safe on these. 
Yeah, if we get on the and get a second, I'm starting to get a little concerned. They definitely paid good money for the box, but paid about 30 bucks for the box. Which I said is probably way overpriced because I would assume you could pick these boxes up for well under 10 bucks, at least the regular boxes, but your regular boxes I don't think have got the uh, rookie sensations. So. But, and I think the Robinsons fallen quite a bit on the bay. Pack down and nothing good to report. So. B. J. Armstrong rookie, another Jordan, another Jordan. Two Jordans in this pack. I'm not sure, but I would think at uh, one point you probably could have gotten five bucks for that Jordan. Well, at this point, this is not looking good. This is uh, 12 packs in. And uh, no rookie sensations. So we're going to stack these out of here so I can get the box out of the way. The bottom pack's definitely been in there, so get a little bit of markings on the box. I'm trying to save it. A little musty. Let me see where. May have seen some, a little bit of water at some point, but. Probably doesn't make that big of a difference, but. 12 packs left, and hopefully, 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 there's a. We start hitting a trend of. Uh, rookie sensations. Pack stinks. This thing definitely smells of mold, but uh, cards didn't look to be affected. And yes, that was me sniffing a card. It's this bad, I may not even post the video. Yeah, I'm recording, so I'll post the video, but... Since these Clecos were searchable, you 